Hi, I'm Kirsten, and I love to create, and happy holidays. And everybody loves a stocking at Christmas. So today, I'm gonna to show you how to personalize, create beautiful stockings with Diamond Dots Freestyle. the supplies that you're gonna need to personalize all of your stockings. First, you're gonna need a stocking, whether you purchased it or you're making it with your favorite fabrics. Then you're gonna need your Dots Light light pad, Diamond Dots sandwich adhesive, a blank grid, and your favorite Diamond Dots alphabet, a marker and a pair of scissors. Then your wax, your stylus, and your tray. And then the most exciting part is pick your Diamond Dots gems that coordinate with your fabric. Then you're gonna need the Dots card and a basic craft brush. Now let's get started. Your first step is creating your stocking. I simply drew a basic stocking pattern, very simple on a piece of paper. You're gonna trace that onto your desired fabric. Cut that out and you can finish it with either fabric glue or a sewing machine. Once you've got your stocking, you're gonna use your Dots Light light pad to personalize and create your pattern. You are gonna place your alphabet on your Dots Light table and using your marker, you're going to create your pattern. Once your pattern is completed, you are going to cut a piece of sandwich adhesive a little bit larger than your design. You are then gonna place your sandwich adhesive over the pattern that you created. And a tip is to tear the backing paper down the middle and just remove it enough to dot that particular area. That way your adhesive is protected while you're dotting your entire design. Once you've dotted, you wanna cut about an eighth of an inch larger around the outside of your dotted design. Peel back your backing paper and carefully apply that to your stocking. You want to use your backing paper to press down your dotted design onto your fabric. It gives you a perfect application. Once that's pressed down, you want to do one last row on the exposed adhesive, giving it a completed and perfect look. Once that's done, you simply want to finish your project with your Dots Guard and a craft brush and that will seal any exposed adhesive and your stocking will be complete. We know you're gonna love personalizing your stockings. We cannot wait to see what you create. Share and like our video and any comments below. We'd love to hear from you guys. See you next time.